Evan from Stock Music Musician here with a very, 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 very super quick tip on how to add VSTs to Reason 9.5. Now, adding Reason VSTs is really simple and straightforward. It basically is just a two-step process, um, but it is based on you knowing where your VSTs are. And every VST is going to install in a slightly different direction. So it's going to be up to you to figure out where they install and that's one of the reasons that rack and extensions have always been so good and we've kind of been spoiled in the rack extension reason community is that rack extensions just automatically install and take care of themselves and vsts don't um but with that said i'm going to show you how to get there now if you're looking for some great vsts to purchase um i made a few recommendations of the ones that i really like and I'm looking forward to using and that I've enjoyed using in Reason so far. But let's show you how to add VSTs to Reason. So you've got this document here and you go to Options. No, sorry, you go to Edit, Preferences down here, and then you go to Advanced Options among these tabs. Now here there's going to be something that says Add VST Plugin Folder. So you just hit Add and you search for your plugins and you click OK and it'll add it. And then it will scan it and then every time you load you might have to close reason and restart reason at that point so that it will uh, that it will actually scan everything and the other thing is that every VST by default tends to be in C colon program files as a nice place to start but um, they might be in other subfolders from there so you're gonna need to pay attention to that now like I said real quick that was just a quick quick video um, if you liked it, if you found this helpful, if you want to learn more about how to use Reason or how to license your music, subscribe, like this, and leave a comment if there's anything else you want to know about Reason 9.5. Thanks.